then uh, it's perfect timing. Then we will proceed now to talk about the next generation of entrepreneurs. Um, in the introduction, I said why it's important to uh, qualify the, the next entrepreneurs and why we have to do train the trainer seminars to set up the business support structures. And I'm very happy that Gintara, um, uh, Paulio Schenkaite, I always pronounce the second name wrong, I'm sorry, from the Vidautas Magnus University will uh, give us an overview about this. Gintara, the floor is yours. Thank you, thank you. I will share my screen. Can you see the presentation? Yes, thank you. Perfect. Okay. So hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Gintare. I represent Vitutas Magnus University, which is Lithuanian University. I've been a part of IMBES project implementation team uh, for almost three years, and I will present the results achieved by our university. Uh, the main objective we have focused on was sustainable skills of entrepreneurship, increase of entrepreneurial qualifications, and increasing the number of candidates willing to take over the business. Uh, for this purpose, we have developed and implemented the following trainings. Uh, the first one is called Train the Trainer Educational Program, which is one of the main tools to strengthen institutional capacities of existing business support organizations for successful business transfers uh, by qualifying qualifying permanent staff of uh, business support organizations as transfer coaches. Uh, the aim of the training is to familiarize the participants with all the tasks of consulting and promotion of business transfers. Uh, the second one is entrepreneurship training educational program, uh, which uh, purpose is to train people to become entrepreneurs to increase the number of well-qualified young entrepreneurs in all uh, Baltic Sea region countries, uh, so that sufficient numbers of qualified entrepreneurs are available for the growing number of SMEs looking to take over. Also ensuring an innovative, successful uh, continuation of the company by the next generation. And the third uh, one is uh, Business Success Force Training Educational Program, which aims to provide the knowledge and capacity building of those with uh, business practices or business education uh, necessary for the successful management of business transfer processes in order not to only keep existing SMEs, but also increase their market value through innovative, successful business growth. Uh, so let's talk about the first one in more detail. Uh, the target groups of train the trainer seminar are uh, teachers and lecturers from universities, colleges, chambers, training institutions who are involved in the training of entrepreneurs and advisors to chambers and other business development agencies involved in advising, coaching, and promoting business transfers and startups. Uh, here you can see the Train the Trainer seminar. Uh, it is a two-day seminar that consists of two main parts, uh, which are training as entrepreneur, uh, introduction and explanation of main training content divided into six modules, and uh, uh, pedagogy as well as coaching and consulting process. Um, the first train the trainer seminar within the INBES project took place in uh, Vilnius on 6 7 May uh, in 2018. Uh, the seminar has been developed and implemented by our university with the intensive support from the Baltic Sea uh, Academy and International Business College as a pilot one uh, to test the most valuable training content for business transfer consultants and coaches. Uh, to develop the seminar's organization schedule, provide hints and arguments uh, that uh, hook while consulting and coaching on business transfer. Uh, to the first train the trainer seminar, all participants came from project partner organizations. In total, uh, there were 24 participants. Uh, and uh, let's have a look at some of the best moments of this training. Uh, here you can see the introduction, uh, all the lecturers. Um, the partners, of course, uh, my colleague uh, and all the project partners participating in the training. Uh, we had also some workshops done and uh, some more presentations and, of course, uh, the certificates of participation. Uh, here you can see an example of the certificate of participation and, uh, of course, the results of uh, the evaluation. Uh, since each lecture and presentation was evaluated by the participants, here we can see the results of this evaluation. Uh, the total usefulness uh, of training for the participants was mostly evaluated as partly useful, 
or useful. Most of the participants recommended to include more workshops rather than lectures. Because I remember that uh, we had a lot of um, theoretical uh, information since it's a new uh, uh, seminar and a new material. So uh, in the future, we will have to work more on adapting it to practical use. Therefore, the Twin to Trainer material will be updated in the Impacts Plus project by our partners. Um, now, let's see what the entrepreneurship training was all about. Here you can see the target group, which is everyone who are interested in entrepreneurship and would like to gain uh, this qualification, students from different uh, levels and fields, graduates, employees seeking for, for their training, business owners uh, preparing for the business transfer, business successors, so that they will be able one day to take over a company. Um, the program consists of six individual modules uh, covering a total of 562 hours. All modules focus on entrepreneurship skills and competences and to be lectured throughout uh, widely used methods of fostering specialization, general and specific competences in management and general social competency. Um, depending on the individual needs of the trainees, only individual modules or the complete training course can be completed uh, and the complete training course is concluded with a recognized continuing education degree as economist. And of course, everyone receives a certificate of participation. Uh, since uh, the entrepreneurship training course consists of 562 hours of training in total, only the selected modules and their parts were tested. Uh, in order to achieve the project outputs, uh, the testing of selected models was carried out uh, two times, once a month. Uh, since the target group is wide, uh, the registration for the training was carried out using Google Forms so that it would be widely available for everyone who is interested in the participation of testing of a new program. Uh, the testing of entrepreneurship training educational program attracted 110 participants in total. Uh, here we can see uh, the best moments of this training, uh, different lectures, different places, some introductions, and of course the evaluation results. Um, uh, at the end of each training day, Vitotas Magnus University has served the certificates of attendance to all the participants and collected the feedback regarding each testing in order to assess the need for revision of the training. So satisfaction with the organization educational institution for the module was assessed as positive by 90% of the participants or more. Satisfaction with the trainer skills competences uh, was uh, assessed as positive by 93% of the participants or more. And personal benefit of the model was assessed as beneficial by 86% of the participants or more. So in our opinion, it is a lot and we are happy with the result we received after the first testing. So so hopefully uh, this uh, program will be adapted in the future by all our partner organizations and other institutions. Uh, and of course, the third training, uh, here we have the target group, which is a bit different uh, uh, because it's entrepreneurs, company business owners, shareholders, company employees, students, graduates, and private and public sector employees seeking in service training or retraining. The main learning objective of business success for training for educational program is to give the target group the knowledge and skills they need to be able to become entrepreneurs that should be divided throughout the following models of the prepared curricula, uh, which you can see in the screen. Depending on the individual needs of the trainees, only individual models or the complete training course can be completed, uh, uh, similar to the um, material in the previous uh, training program. Uh, the modelized concept curricula and documentation for training for successor activities was tested in Vilnius, Lithuania in 2020, in fall. Um, we had uh, 52 participants uh, in uh, the first lecture, 29 in total in the second one, and 25 in the third one. This is because of the situation with pandemic, and uh, it is important to note that this training was implemented during the hard uh, times. So in order to achieve the target group, uh, all three models were test translated live on a Vitotas Magnus University Facebook account. So we had uh, some online participation. 
And uh, here we can see the reality of pandemic training. Um, I would like also would like to mention that uh, we did this training uh, the last week before the second uh, closing of everything. So that's why there are only a few people, unfortunately. And here you can see uh, the online uh, translation. Um, and of course, the evaluation results of the participants. So uh, despite the fact that we had this before the second lockdown, uh, we received a good feedback, uh, 94, 95, uh, 95 of the participants, uh, percent of the participants were happy with the results, with the material, with the lectures. Uh, so we are happy with what we achieved and we think uh, it is adaptable to all the organizations that are interested in the material. So thank you for your time. Uh, I tried to speak fast, hopefully not too fast. Uh, and uh, if you would like to get some more information to see the uh, material of the training, to read it, uh, you can always contact us because I think it's not completely available on the InBets website since, uh, for example, entrepreneurship training is 562 hours. So you can understand the amount of uh, information we have. So. Um, you can also always uh, contact me or uh, head of uh, our organization of this project, uh, Professor Vitas Navitskas. Uh, and uh, of course, thank you for your time. Thank you very much, Quintana. Yes, uh, lots of information and you had to speak fast. So because there's so much to inform about. And um, I'm also very thankful that you were able to implement the trainings because in the projects we not only develop training and curricula, but it's always necessary and important for us to put them into action and that you managed to do that despite the pandemic uh, last year. Uh, it's quite amazing and uh, we were ha very happy that you managed to do that even with a few participants, but in the lockdown, most people didn't do anything uh, like that, so it was great. And um, any questions to Gintari? It's so many trainings at different levels for people working in uh, support agencies, for uh, entrepreneurs and for students. So lots and lots of information. I'm checking if there's something on the palette. No, 